Hello boys and girls, it's a new and another week. It's been a very busy week this week. Lots of adventures have been had and fun events around the school. We've had excursions, we've had the 100 days of prep. We've got so much to share with you all. So let's hand you over to Selma for the formalities before we look at all the fun things that have been happening this week. It's now time for the national anthem. Could everyone please stand up quietly? Could everyone please be seated? Okay. Now we'd like to recite our school oath. The flag reminds us that Australia is our home. We respect our parents, friends, teachers, school and community. We believe that everyone is important and deserves a fair go. We want to make Bethel a fair, safe and happy place for everyone. We acknowledge the traditional custodians of country throughout Australia and their connections to land, sea and community. We pay our respects to their elders past and present and extend that respect to all Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander peoples today. Breakfast Club is now happening on Monday, on Tuesday, on Wednesday, on Thursday, on Friday. It is happening on every single school day. So come on down, 8.30am in the Burr Building. Have yourself some breakfast, the more the merrier. And we'll see all your smiling faces down there next week, I'm sure. Can you believe we are already beginning to plan for 2025? My goodness, time flies when you are having fun at Bethel Primary School. What that means, though, is that you might have a little brother or a little sister or a, or a cousin or somebody you know who is about to start school. And if that's the case, you need to let them know that it is time to tell our school office and get your enrolment forms in. And do us a favour as well and tell us, tell everyone how amazing our wonderful school is because we think it's pretty great and we'd love to keep adding more students through prep each and every year. So get those enrolment forms in so your family members or your friends can join you at Bethel Primary School.
Oh, Mr. Warren, what are you holding there? Well, I've got our latest Spotlight Award winner. Mm. And it goes to somebody who went on an excursion the other day to ScienceWorks and they did a fantastic job in showing respect and actually helping uh, some members of the school community with how to access some equipment. And she had a lovely manner and she represented our school so fantastically well. And this person is in Miss Lambert's grade. And Miss Lambert thought they did such a great job that they just had to get a Spotlight Award. So without further ado, the Spotlight Award winner is... Should we do a drum roll? We'll do a drum roll, ready? Right. Here we go. Come on, everybody. Drum roll on. Mira! Congratulations, Mira. So, so proud of you. Tuesday, we went to Science Works to learn about forces. Science Works was the air program. Bouncy Castle is called Squish. In the Bouncy Castle, we all had three minutes to play around. The part was the STEM lab, we made roller coasters. Two different sizes of wooden balls to experiment our roller coasters. This Wednesday we had an educational trip to the zoo. We met a lady named Sally and she showed us and told us all about the adaptations of animals. Today we went to the zoo. Hi everyone, I am back this week Hello. to give you your house points update. Sorry, I wasn't here last week, but Mr. Wilson did a great job in my absence. So thank you, Mr. Wilson. So this week in fourth place with 153 house points, we have Laura Keats. In third place with 154 points, we have Rosella. In second place on 165 points, we have Kingfisher. And with quite a big lead, currently in first place on 191 house points, My goodness. we have Thornbill. Wow. Very exciting, Thornbill. All other students, you should be watching our Thornbill students and taking a lead from them. They're obviously doing a great job showing our school values. Keep up the great work. And I hope, Rosella, you have a fabulous time celebrating your house points victory today. Hello girls and boys and school community. I know I say it a lot, but this week has been a massive week at Bethel Primary School with excursions, 100 Days Foundation, and so many other things. And as you heard before, we have a new Spotlight Award winner. What a beautiful week it is. Looking forward to next week, uh, when we as a school probably start to think about book week and all the great things that will happen in there in three or four weeks when that is on. And I know that myself, Mr. Wilson, Miss Salamet, and Miss Mikulif 
have just come for a meeting where we've been talking about what costumes that we'll be getting dressed up into. So plenty to look forward to next week and the coming weeks as well. As always, stay safe with family and friends on the weekend. But until Monday, that is me, signing off.